What's happening, ladies and gentlemen? It's your main man back one more time. Yes, with another juicy segment today for you. Are you re- 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 ready? Are you ready? Hmm? Of course you are. Of course you are. Before we get started into this juicy segment today, ladies and gentlemen, I need you all to like and subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be reminded for juicy content coming up that you will find exclusively here on this channel. Yes, indeed. Don't forget to go to overcomersgroupllc.com. If you need a motivational speaker who will ignite your intuition, who will excite your mind, that is correct. You heard it giving you all the tools that you will be able to find how to overcome any obstacle with the assess address and progress formula let's go let us go are you ready ladies and gentlemen i'm going to show you how to overcome any obstacle today with your intuition by way of the assess address and progress formula that i have incorporated into my life and well-being if you get this deep down inside of your soul inside of your mind inside of your body you will not be the same make no mistake about it I, that you heard that correctly i said make no mistake about it now let's get right into it huh this story i'm about to tell you is going to shift your thinking as to how i was able to use the assess address progress formula without even knowing it in other words my intuition tuned into it i'm going to give you this tool that you have come to this earth already equipped with ladies and gentlemen are you ready let's go let's go let's go it is go time and it is show time straight to the point no fluff pay attention to this story please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell in case you didn't or in case you missed it the first time I asked or requested you to do so, okay? In 2007, the assess, address, and progress formula that will assist your life, that assisted mine then in this critical moment, in this critical moment, yes, of my life. I started my day and my journey. Checked on my mom and all was well there. Got myself together in my hygiene and I set out on my journey. I caught the bus in Madison, Wisconsin. Troy Drive and if I'm not mistaken, Sherman Avenue intersection there. And the morning was beautiful, very beautiful. I say this to start because this story is realistic and is a reality in my life. And as my story is different from yours, I'm going to show you how the assess, address, and progress formula works every time to your well-being. I started my day. It was beautiful outside. Yes, indeed, I had to run a few errands and I had to go downtown. Yes, I had to go downtown because I had business down on State Street during this time. Mind you, birds trip, the busyness of the hustle and bustle out by that area of my life at the time, by that geographical location of the time. It was a serene and calm day. This was the assessment, yes. I assessed what I had to do, as you will assess what you have to do in your journey. At the time, you applied this information, okay? You figure, like me, well, you have a goal in your day. I had a goal in my day. My goal was to get to talk to important people down on the square and connect with a few people so that I could increase my value in the marketplace. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
I had to address my need to do so. The need, I didn't desire to walk. I had to address, well, to address that factor, I had to set aside bus fare money at the time because I didn't have a car. My mind is already elevated on wealth, health, yes, Mm -hmm. for my mind, body, and soul anyway. My mind is already there. Which is why I had to address the situation. In your situation, whichever way it falls for you or is for you, you will address your duty to do what you need to do in your journey. Whatever your task is, you need to address how to get from your point A to your point B, the end result, basically. Okay? Now, in a nutshell, here we go. Are you ready for this, what I'm about to give you? Because this right here, you do not desire to miss. You don't want to miss this one. Mm -mm. Straight to the point. Straight to the point. Here it is. I finished my day downtown. Yes, indeed. I finished my day downtown. I've got to address getting back to my humble abode at the time. Okay? Yes, I took care of every need that I needed for myself and my family at the time with what resources I had. At the time, I wasn't where my goal totally was in my day-to-day -day as to finding my results to what I wanted to do. But hey, I had to start somewhere. And right there at that point in time, I had to find a way and means to again increase my value in the marketplace yes mm -hmm. earn a living make money do all the things that i need to do that would help me have a sustained and a livable lifestyle well on the way home as the assess address and progress formula is in and of and on total autopilot without me even knowing at this time I get ready to near my stop I pulls the bus line bell to notify the bus driver that my stop is nearing prior to nearing my stop I came to the transfer point there on the north side of Madison Wisconsin during the time closest to Troy Drive where I was residing at at the time and it was beautiful yes it was beautiful at that point when I got there but all of a sudden it turned from sunshine blue clouds to almost in a blink of an eye a snap of a finger great clouds very dreary wind kicks up like nobody's business. Well, a sprinkle here, a sprinkle there. I'm on the bus by this time. It is as if the clouds swole up unfathomably at the time. Well, I leave the transfer point and like I said at this point, like I said at this point, I near my stop to get off so that I could walk the remaining distance to my humble abode at the time ladies and gentlemen in the blink of an eye it started almost monsoon raining i hear a very no excuse me we hear a very very loud crack boom pop yes the sound of loud thunder rain everywhere water almost as if it is flooding Ladies and gentlemen, by the grace of my proprietor, the Prince of Peace, the assess, address, and progress factor and formula saved my life. Yes, saved my life. It has this capability to save yours as well. A block away from where I stopped, that loud crack, that loud pop, was the power line that was snapped by a lightning bolt 
Oh, help me, help me, help me. Help me. Heavenly Father, as I tell the story, as I simply desire to impart, give to you a key formula that will work 24 hours a day, seven days a week, no matter what the weather will or will not do. Faith. Faith. Get it deep down in you. Study what this word is. Study it. Study how the Prince of Peace is. Study because he takes over in crunch time. His spirit takes over in crunch time. He loves you. He loves you. Yes, he does. Accept him as your savior. Accept him as your savior. I say this because that day I wasn't the smartest. All of my education went away because fear got the best of me that day. But I was on autopilot and I didn't miss a beat. It is as if my five senses were calm subconsciously overpowering the conscious mind and I didn't even know it because screams, yells, and all types of information, noise, sounds were happening at the same time here. And what happened next, ladies and gentlemen, you won't believe. You will not believe what happened. Well, it came to a stop. The bus did. And just before I got to the stop, I was able to see two people fall. Yes, two people fall in the water near the stop. I was frightened myself, ladies and gentlemen. And I was in back of a man who knew the two people that fell. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the power line was in the water submerged and the people coming to the bus didn't know. As they were coming to the bus, go figure. Well, as the assess address of progress formula was happening for me and why I have to share this with you because it works 24 hours a day, seven days a week. There was a man in the front of me. I was sitting in back of him. He knew the two people that fell. He got off the bus not knowing the current was live. And at that point, not knowing what to do, my concern for my fellow men and women and little one at the time. As I had no control over the weather at all. I had zero control, like I said prior to this. It was sunny that day. And all of a sudden, in the blink of an eye, it started monsoon raining, thundering and lightning. Well, the reason I say this is because, ladies and gentlemen, you do have an instinct and intuition. God gave it to you. In this day and age, moving forward, if you trust and lean on him, you will overcome any obstacle. And I don't, I don't say this to the unfortunate acts, but it's by grace that I'm here today. Because that man did not get two steps off of the bus. As his body lay there, yes, lay there. Mm -hmm. I was concerned to the point to where I put aside my own emotions too. And I wanted to do something because there was lots of water. From one perspective, possibly a foot of water, ladies and gentlemen, on a simple curve. This is an everyday routine situation too. So many 
people have gotten on and off the bus daily and nothing extraordinary has happened like such. So this was a normal move. Anybody could have made this mistake. I could have too, because I'm going to tell you how. Because something, my intuition, my instinct, the Prince of Peace, the assess, address, and progress formula that worked 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I had no Bible. Mm -mm. And I was not even into church like this. I wasn't studying the Bible like this, y'all. Uh-uh, no, uh-uh. And I, at the time, I had a terrible habit of smoking cigarettes at the time. Yes, and I kicked that. That's another subject for another time, but I'm just trying to tell you. As I saw, I went to the front of the bus to get off to try to pull him back onto the bus as he lay right there. Something told me to hold on to the doors of the bus before I attempt to pull this man back on the bus to try to save his life. I didn't know that he was gone. However, something told me to take my time and go slow and do not let go of the door at all. Do not put your foot into the water right there because something is definitely wrong. I don't, I, I tune into this formula that works. Critical times, serious. And I was cautious, ladies and gentlemen, to kind of put my hand close to this man's body that was right there. I could look down and see him not moving anymore. And as I was going to pull his being, his leg or his body to me, I felt how hot the current was and had to turn around and sit down because I had to wait for Madison Gas and Electric. We all had to wait for Madison Gas and electric to cut the power line off on this very horrible day ladies and gentlemen i'm fortunate to be here we only got one shot in this world you can have anything you put your mind to and if you hold on long enough no matter what you go through ladies and gentlemen this is one of the juiciest segments that you will ever experience you heard it here exclusively on this channel. That is correct. Your main man, Vernon T. V. A. U. To the J. H. N. Reporting live right now for you to have a better mind, body, and soul. Ladies and gentlemen, I send you shouts out of peace. Obtain this formula that will definitely work 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I make no mistake about what I boldly state. I'm not worried about a pain at this point. When it's about you, it's about you. We have gone through some precedented times. Think about it. Think about it. I don't even desire to say the name of this recent time, one portion struggle, adversity, the list could go on and on. But you are here for a reason. And that reason is so that you can be a better you, baby. Till next time, take care.